Okay, welcome to KG Constrictor's first YouTube video. Still trying to get my camcorder uh, to work correctly, so instead I've decided to use the digital camera. What we're looking at here is my Super Salmon female and a pretty large ovulation. I don't know if it's easy to get an idea here, but uh, she is, she's had three litters in the past. It's looking like she's going to have litter number four, probably sometime in April. Uh, this year I put her with my albino male Thor, so she'll produce a nice litter of double head sun glows. And she's extremely uh, swollen there. You can see the good scale separation. Excuse the cage, it's, a, it's uh, usually pretty messy during breeding. I don't get to do a lot of cleaning. But uh, these two have not copulated now in a couple of days at least. So that pretty much tells me uh, his job is done. He'll continue to kind of cuddle and snuggle with her. But as far as the, uh, the actual copulation is done, the next thing I'm going to wait for, I'm going to wait for her to... Um, to shed and then I'm going to count about a hundred or a hundred and one days from the shed. I'm expecting the sheds probably going to be oh anytime in the next couple weeks uh, and then that'll be the uh, the date for the babies. You can kind of see here <laughs> as gross as this is this is a little piece of dried Thor sperm. I saw him uh, rubbing on it last night with his tail so hey you know I guess uh, any way you can get it but um, she's a great snake. She was born in 2003. And as I said, she's had three awesome litters. So this is going to be litter number four if all goes well for her. Uh, usually, you should see her first two litters were in uh, June of 06 and 07. Last year, or this past year's litter was a little earlier, May 25th. This litter is definitely going to come in April. I'll see if I can zoom in on her, but uh, her name is Farah, and she is just uh, she's a great snake, great breeder, 